Hello and welcome. A new case in probability distribution. In this case, we are going to construct a probability distribution of number of successes where the success is to get a number greater than 4 when a die is tossed twice. When a die is tossed two times, that means there are two trials getting a number greater than 4 that is 5 or 6 is success. So if a die is tossed twice that means there are two trials so there will be three possible outcomes and there are no success, one success and all the two successes. What is no success? That means failure and failure. So the probability will be Failure is 2 by 3 multiplied by 2 by 3, so it comes to 4 by 9. One success. In how many ways one success is possible? It is possible in these two ways. Success in first trial and failure in the second or failure in the first trial and su success in second. So the probability will be success that is 1 by 3 into failure 2 by 3. And failure 2 by 3 into success 1 by 3. So it is 2 by 9 plus 2 by 9 that is 4 by 9. And success in both the trials or both the tosses. So success in first trial and success in second. So probability is success in first trial and success in second so it is 1 by 9 4 by 9 plus 4 by 9 plus 1 by 9 it comes to 9 by 9 or 1 because all these three are mutually exclusive and possible outcomes of the experiment now the probability distribution the random variable x to be Defined as number of successes can take value 0, 1 or 2. Respective probabilities are 4 by 9, 4 by 9 and 1 by 9. Now to find expected value we have to multiply these two columns. X into P of X. 0 into anything 0. 1 into 4 by 9 is 4 by 9. And 2 into 1 by 9 is 4 by 9. So it comes to 6 by 9. This is our e of x expected value of x to find the variance we have to find the e of x square that means expected value of the squared value of the random variable x square into p of x it is nothing x into x into p of x so 0 into 0 0 1 into 4 by 9 4 by 9 2 into 2 by 9 is also 4 by 9 so it comes to 8 by 9. That is expected value of x square. Mean or e of x is 6 by 9. That is 2 by 3. Variance is e of x square minus e of x the whole square. E of x square is 8 by 9 minus square of 2 by 3 that is 8 by 9 minus 4 by 9. So the variance comes to 8 minus 4, 4 by 9. Standard deviation is nothing, it is square root of variance under root 4 by 9, so it comes to 2 by 3. Thus, in this case, mean and standard deviation both are equal. That's it. Thank you very much.